Yo, 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 this is the pickle. And we're back for Tomb Raider. And I'm sure everyone's confused because uh, I've missed an episode here and there. And, uh, that's not actually, that's actually what harms on me. That's not because I haven't recorded it, it's because I forgot to upload it. Um, so yeah, if you ignore the uh, forgetting to upload bits and pieces here, it wouldn't be so bad. But, so we're in this cavey thing. And apparently it's going to continue on our merry way. Oops, I don't want it, this button. So we have this. So I believe these are ba this is the Baba Yaga thing. So we want to make sure we do those. Because those are side objectives, not the main. So like if I really wanted to just continue with the story, I could. But I'm going to just complete as much as I can. Because I really love this game. I love the graphics. I love everything there is about it. So where am I? Oh, well, that's pretty neat. New base camp discovered. Overwatch, we have contact with the native in the old sawmill. We've wounded her, but it looks like they set traps around the perimeter. I've got one casualty so far. Doing a sweep. Ouch. There's a cache thing down there. Okay. So that's where this is. It's an optional mission available. Don't shoot. I'm with Jacob. He told us to wait for you, but these bastards found us first. Oh, God. Are you all right? I'll live. But I need a safe place to rest in case the invaders return. There's a cave across the bridge over there. A wolf den. They won't look there, but I can't clear it out on my own. Not like this. If you could kill them, we'll have a safe place to regroup. I might even have something for that pistol of yours. Can you help us? Yes, I can. Except... Yes, of course. Stay out of sight. I'll be back. Thank you. Jacob was right about you. The wolf den's already clear, I think. Here's the octopus. I'm pretty sure that den is clear. Do not let the target slip away. We need to know why they were following Bravo Team. Someone in here, it's safe. You can come out now. <sighs> Must still be hiding. Okay. <laughs> I don't want that. I want to wait to do. So we fall up on everything. <sighs> they must still be hiding in here. There's more Baba Yaga stuff going on. Are we not skin these? I thought we could. I'm not gonna lie, I'm taking the brutal apart approach shooting first.
Pretty sure his den is already clear, so. Right? I'm gonna wander through here just to make sure. not how I would have planned on doing it, but no. I'm going one way to skin a cat on this, so I did not feel like uh, waiting around. So uh, I think it's clear now. Okay, that scared the shit out of me. Did not expect that many. Okay, and we got the Baba Yaga thing to do too, but I want to get the uh, optional objective done first. I'm trying to get these off one at a time. Let's hold. So, uh... I've already forgotten how does this work over here. Yeah. And then we got to deal with the captives. We'll deal with them in a minute. I'm trying to, get, just trying to clear these off as quick as possible. She runs so weirdly. Did you clear out the cave? Is it safe? The cave is clear. If you head there now, you'll be safe. Thank you. Here, take this. Jacob told us to protect you, but you weren't the one who needed it. Sweet pistol sights. And 3,000 credits. Do the beneficial award rewards. And now there's a whole bunch of people hiding in the sawmill that we need to take care of, so let's do that real fast. Maybe one of these lockers. Yep, yep. Blood. It hurt. Closer. I'm not with Trinity. My name is Lara, and your gun isn't loaded. I can see the cylinder is empty. The firing pin never worked anyway. You're hurt. I just need to sit down for a moment. Lara, was it? I'm Nadia. I could use your help. Noticed. What can I do? My grandfather snuck out of the village in the night. I think he's headed for the Wicked Vale, where the witch Baba Yaga lives. I was trying to catch up with him when the invaders caught me. Before Ouch. I was born, the witch killed my grandmother. Grandpa always talked about revenge, but I never thought he'd actually go through with it. There isn't much time, and I'm in no condition to go myself. We have to find him. I don't know what she's even hurt. She looks fine, but okay. I'll accept your mission. I'll head out that way and see if I can pick up his trail. The path to the Vale is through the cave to the east of here. So there's one over there now. Do I gotta do these all one at a fucking time? <sighs> Jacob's people were forced to work here. Hmm. Oh yeah, you know that den that I specified that I didn't want anything to do with you? That's the den they were gonna make me go through. out there. I'm not trained for this shit. Yeah, I don't fuck around, dude. You know, th th those kind of suck. Sweet. Are there more of them? Because if there's more of them, I don't I don't want anything to do with this place. There's 
a trail here. Well worn. Oh, let's jump through, I guess. A tomb nearby too, and that's the part that I'm confused about. The tomb must be outside and against the wall or something, so I'm gonna assume. It must be like below it. invaders you killed. Can you hear me? Loud and clear. I can monitor the invaders' frequencies from here while I patch myself up. I'll let you know if I hear anything useful. Sweet. <sighs> That's one of those plus that I personally don't like. Okay, campsite. Got skill points for one. Okay. Um. Um, should hit shots. I seem to be pretty good at ammunition so far. What's under here? Um, enemies killed or knocked out. Got to handle objects. Okay. Got to explosive bombs from red cans and deadly proximity mines from enemy radios. I don't like using craftables, so for now I'm gonna skip over that one. Significant less damage from explosives and fire. Enemies killed once stealth on a good for resources and bandage wounds more quickly effective and quickly the faster heal the fast healer skill. Um Man, I just don't know. None of these are really like sticking out. I guess the amount of ammunition looted from enemy corpses, even though I'm not really needing bullets. I mean, I seem to be running fine, but if I keep using what I am, I'm going to. Now let's do double shot. I want to know what it does. We'll zoom in with a fully charged bow shot. Multiple targets can be locked by holding aim over for a short period of time. When released arrows will strike multiple enemies simultaneously. Red lock symbols indicate lock targets and position of the indicator shows where the shots will hit when fired. Either body or head. Huh. I, I'm curious on how it works, so that'll be fun. Let's go to the recurve bow. Let's figure out. Okay, see, all of those upgrades are done. This is recoil stability, not super important. Rate of fire, recoil stability, reload speed, ammo capacity. 
I would think the, this one's really needed, but I'm gonna go over here and this one. You know what? I think this is a good time to go, um, instead of looking at weapons, go to upgrades for inventory. And look at equipment stuff. Medium size 30 hide quiver that increases the carrying capacity for all arrow types. It's a pistol. I think a rifle ammo pouch is really what I need here. So let's get this and we'll get this one. And from there, let's go ahead and look see do we have anything we can do for weapon upgrades? I mean I'm sure there is. Oh yeah. Regal stability we don't though. So there's that. Reloads people. We do a frame capacity, so let's go ahead and do that. Because I seem to be using that gun quite a bit, and I think it's going to be more and more as time goes on. So we're going to hang on to that. That seems like a really good one to have. Um, what more can you tell me about the Wicked Vale, Nadia? My people stay far away from that place. They have for centuries. When the Soviets were here, they tried to build an outpost in the Vale. But they angered Baba Yaga, and she drove them all mad. Grandpa told me all about her. She lives in a magic house that can walk with the legs of a bird. Do you believe all that? The house with the bird legs? I trust Grandpa. He was in the Gulag when the Soviets took my grandmother into the Vale to help them study the ruins. The witch killed her, and he's never forgotten that. But a witch straight out of a Russian folktale? It sounds unlikely. Just be careful. Something is in the veil. Nothing good happens in that place. I mean, I've witnessed all kinds of things that don't happen in great places, so you know. That's cool. Last time I did this, we almost died. These mountains seem a little bit sturdier, though. So, yeah, there's that. grandfather did this optional challenge to him Laura hang on I'm picking up a transmission you need to hear this out there. Whatever it is, we'll get to the bottom of it. Let's start the map button. So is that an optional challenge tomb right there? Is that what we gathered? So I'm off the map right now. There's nothing over here. Okay. Yeah, optional challenge to him here, so. Um, 
I'm, I'm trash. Okay, I jumped a little bit. I did not expect that to do that much. I should have, but I didn't. Okay, we're good this time. You know, we're ready for it. From pop the crap they do in this game, it kind of should be an expected thing, but... I almost got used to it not being an expected thing. Yeah. No need to go inside the old temple. Head down to the wooden walkway along the cliff. There should be a rope leading to it. That path will take you straight to the veil. That's not, that's not the map button, guys. Okay. But what's in the temple? What is that sound? Cash. I will take that. Hmm. Okay. More stuff. I don't need to go in here, but I am an archaeologist, so that's what I do. Without this place, this divine sculpture of wind and rock, we would have been lost. The story of the scout who found this place is well known to us all. But most of you do not know how close we came to dying. We were lost in the mountains. No food, no hope. We had begun to doubt the prophet himself. But the scout heard the sound and took it to be a sign. He alone ascended these cliffs, drawn by the music. And from there, he saw our salvation. This is not just a shrine to him and his bravery, but to the strength of our faith. Huh. But I'm going to end the episode off here. We can finish with, I think this is a tomb, I think. So yeah, we'll finish this. We'll kind of finish off all the tomb and stuff uh, in the hmm. next episode. This was some sort of a shrine. Pilgrims came here to show their respect. Thanks. Yeah, see y'all in the next one. Peace.